No wake zone. <laughs> what are you doing, man? <laughs> Lots of action going on today. We got that tow boat coming by. Boat traffic's pretty wild. I'm down on 2nd Street. I'm gonna try some fishing down here, see what I can catch. I got uh, shrimp, shrimp fish bites, frozen squid, calamari style. Oh, and uh, sand fleas too, frozen sand fleas. So I'm gonna try to see what I can catch see what's down here what's biting it's like late summer right now if you're new to my channel my name is Jay I live just outside of Ocean City I live uh, a small community called Ocean Pines and uh, I come down here to Ocean City a lot and I fish down here so uh, yep a second street today see what I can catch all right let me get rigged up and I'll get to fishing explain what I'm using uh, all that stuff I'm just using a standard uh, high-low rig, and uh, if you don't know how to tie them, you can get them on my website, realjb.com. I sell them on there. They're all hand-tied, uh, and um, this one I have uh, two o circle hooks, two out circle hooks, and the weight that I use is actually it's an eight ounce. Uh, in this area, I'll use eight to nine ounce weights. Little diver duck coming because the current rips through here so fast. Leader is uh, 50 pound and uh, the rod is a 10 foot. Uh, this is the one I use for surf fishing all the time. It's a 10 foot rod, 50 pound braid on there too. All right, let's see what's here. See, the 8-ounce weight is already getting sucked down to the, the right of me. The current's uh, incoming. Getting some bites here. That didn't take too long. It's probably going to be sea bass is what it feels like. Piece of shrimp. Cut it in half. Put it on the hook all the way through. all the way through so it sits just like that do the same to the top one all the way through yeah it's sea bass picking it off we'll drop it back down they took the first one the bottom one already I think they ate it all yeah all right put some more back on i just got the uh small shrimp and then i just cut them in half i put some fish bites on there too try to keep the keep it on there a little longer it's like instant bites sea bass little tiny guys there's no real like size to these things here they get to keep them they got to be 13 inches you're never going to catch one in the bay they're all really small uh six seven eight nine i've caught a 10 inch one before but that's the biggest i caught uh, out in the ocean is where you get the big ones and usually there's if there's one there's a whole bunch that kid is not happy It's weird that none of them have eaten the top piece. It's only been the bottom one. See, normally, like, the crazy thing about it is normally if there's no bait on the bottom one, they go to the other one. They just don't eat the top one at all. It's, I don't know. 
It's a weird day for fishing. Get some juice out there. It's getting so warm, the shrimp are like cooking in the bag. Is that one? Making Real Time. I like that name. Making Real Time. Get out of here, duck. Before I go, I got a little eel on my toadfish rod. I'm gonna throw that for a little bit and see if there's any. Sometimes uh, in the, the summertime when the water gets really warm in the bay, there's a fish called a cutlass fish or a ribbon fish. They're mean looking, but they're fun to catch. Big teeth to them. Instant. Just got a good bite. Minnows are everywhere. That's a decent one. A little bigger. And choke that thing down. Here's what I'm showing you about the size. The, that one's only like six inches. So they don't they don't get very big here. There's a, a video that I did of um, me and my neighbor Bob, and he, uh, him and I went out fishing for sea bass. So if you watch that, we went offshore, and you can see that there are bigger ones out there. Do they eat at all? Bigger sea bass. I think uh, th that's the biggest one of the day. But that's not what was eating you, sir. Felt way bigger than what you actually are. Another one. That's not. Man, what is that? That's a fat one. Wow. He was feisty. Get out of there. Oh, twinsies on the collars. <laughs> OC Bayhopper, my guy. That's a lot of fun if you ever, if you ever want to take a shuttle around Ocean City and avoid all the traffic and just kind of a fun, fun activity to do, that's definitely the way to do it. OCBayhopper.com, it's an app. You download the app on your phone and then you schedule it. It's it's relatively cheap. A mahi carcass. All right, I'm out. That's it. Done, done, done. At least I caught something. I was wondering what was down here this sort of late in the summertime, so it was pretty cool. Fun time down here. Um, yes, yeah, Second Street is where I'm at. Second through fourth, it's all a free fishing area. Um, you can go all the way down to Fourth Street, but they're doing a lot of construction to the park. So you can't park down there, but you can walk and you can fish down there. But this is it. So, all right, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.